You mentioned that you're nine weeks along. It sounds like you went to the doctor and had an ultrasound done and they said that the gestational sac was empty. And I'm so sorry. My heart goes out to you for your loss because this is a, a kind of miscarriage. Um, it's also known as a blighted ovum and this is where an egg is fertilized. It attaches to the uterine wall, but cells don't develop inside. And it's usually due to chromosomal abnormalities. Um, the body may continue to release human chorionic gonadotropin or HCG, which is the hormone that home pregnancy tests detect. And so a woman gets a positive pregnancy test result and may think she's pregnant until it's discovered at some point in pregnancy when an ultrasound is done. That is the way to diagnose a blighted ovum. Um, you look at the gestational sac and by nine weeks, um, a fetus should be about the size of a grape and even have little developing hands and feet. And so at this point, something would be seen if things were, were progressing as they should. And so since there's an empty sac, your doctor probably talked to you about a plan. Um, if your body doesn't naturally start miscarrying, then intervention will be necessary in order to prevent complications for your body. Um, again, I'm so sorry. And I do suggest talking with your doctor again about your questions and concerns. Maybe they could sit down with you and look at the ultrasound images, explain things a little bit better and help you through the grieving process. I hope the best for you in the future. And if you have more questions, then please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash intermountainmoms.